One of the most exciting discoveries of recent years are gravitational waves. These are ripples in the fabric of space and time predicted by Albert Einstein more than 100 years ago. And what this discovery showed was the collision of two massive black holes in the distant universe that sent these violent waves out through the universe before reaching Earth uh, after billions and billions of years traveling through space. So the LHC is this gigantic 27 kilometer donut and what it does is really kind of simple and quite brutal. It takes subatomic particles called protons, whizzes them round and round and round in a circle until they're going at just a tiny fraction below the speed of light and then smashes them into each other. And when they collide out of their energy, new particles are created, which people like me then study using huge detectors that surround the collision point. So in these collisions, what we're looking for are signs of new particles that have never been seen in the universe before. So that's things like the Higgs boson, which was discovered back in 2012, or particles of dark matter that could explain what most of the universe is made out of. We don't know what dark matter is. We know it's out there, but there's about five times more dark matter than the ordinary matter that you and I are made out of. It's out there in space. It affects the way that stars move around, the way that galaxies move around, but we actually have no idea what it is. And that's what we're looking for at the Large Hadron Collider and other uh, dark matter experiments all over the world.